Hi guys, welcome back. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for continuing supporting me. And if you're a first time viewer, please subscribe and like to see more content. Alright, today I'm going to show you a quick, you know, look around of the progress that has happened since I planted a few things and have shown you guys me cleaning up the the crops you know the cucumbers and the the lettuce and the stuff that i had planted out i'm going to show you guys the progress on how they are now and yeah i hope you guys enjoy <laughs> This is the body bean here. It have a lot coming up. They're still small. They're not ready to pick us yet. Um, yeah, and we planted some pimentos around this area. Pimentos. No, wait. These are sweet pepper. Sorry. Planted some sweet peppers in this area around here. And as you can see, the lettuce, cabbage, and kale has gotten a lot bigger. I find them to be very beautiful, especially these lettuce here. The purple leaves on them. I find this. I find them to be so beautiful. They look so pretty. Oh, my favorite one. My favorite one is this one. I find her to be very beautiful. Yes, I'm giving her a gender because she is so pretty. I just love these purple color on the lettuce. They are called iceberg lettuce. Yeah. And then there are the regular green ones that we see all the time the regular green ones are coming up the pak choy are doing very well the pak choy has grown the most out of everything the pak choy has gotten a lot bigger and the kale the kale are still small, but they are getting there. They're getting there pretty quickly. Ah. Kills are doing really nice. Okay, now let's go off to the other side. To see the tomatoes. Tomatoes has beard a lot. When these are ready to pick, we're gonna have a lot of tomatoes. You might have to give away to the neighbors and to my grandparents. I mean, look at how much are on the trees. Oh yeah, and I actually did these. I broke off some. I broke off some banana leaves and tied it to the tomato to hold it up. Some dry tomato leaves. I mean, no, <laughs> some dry banana leaves. Some dry banana leaves and tie them up. There's some dried banana leaves right over there. All these tomatoes are coming up real nice. And the pak choy. Yeah, the pak choy has been doing really well. Those have been good. 
pretty well on their own without any manual or pesticides or anything like that. Then we have some string beans here. These are some more. Why do I? Why am I keep? Why I keep calling them string beans? These are body beans. I don't know why I keep calling them string beans, but these are body beans. They have a lot on this tree. See, and now we have the okra. They are really big, but I'm leaving these to get the seed from them we're leaving them to dry so we could get the seeds because I want I want to get more seeds from this plant to grow because these okra grow really big we got them from a good friend named Miss Lisa she gave us the seeds for these plants and they're doing really good And the cucumbers are doing well too. I mean, we had a few problems with them. Something was coming up on the leaves. I don't know what it is. If you guys know what is this issue, what causes this issue, please comment and say um, what can I do to fix it. And yeah these are growing a lot of flowers because a lot of cucumbers from them already you see got a lot of cucumbers from each one of them let's even have a little baby cucumber here let's see and let's have more coming up some more coming up there focus and the rest there is the cassava trees okay planted these sweet peppers the sweet peppers doesn't look too well I'm hoping that they catch. Yeah. Everything that we got outside today got a lot of string beans, or body beans, and cucumbers. Got a lot of those. We got this small one here. And we've got two avocados from our tree. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed the short video. Um, just to show you guys the progress of what has been happening since I planted the lettuce in the half pipes. And just show you the other crops and the produce that we've been getting. And I hope you guys enjoyed the short clip of everything in